What's up guys, I'm Audrey Cleo for Young Hollywood, hanging out on the set of The Millers about a family that puts the fun in dysfunctional. You guys film part of this in front of a live studio audience. You're doing that tomorrow, right? Yeah, we're shooting in front of an audience tomorrow night, yeah. What, what's that like for you to have that energy, but also all those eyeballs on you? It's great. No, I, you know, it, it's something, uh, it's kind of a new experience for me, and uh, I really enjoy it. I think this is probably the only format where you're bringing in all the aspects of, of entertaining. You know? mm -hmm. I mean, you, you have the live audience on Fridays, which uh, is always really exciting. Uh, we never feel we're quite ready. It's like opening night every Friday. So the bounce and fun of going out and being in front of a, a, of an, of a live audience just lifts you up and takes you to another level. It's great. Is there more pressure because there's so many eyeballs on you? It's, right it's in front actually of you? turned into less pressure now. And you know what? It, it's show business. Right. I mean, it's just a play. I mean, it's just a television show. You, you can mess up. You just mm -hmm. have to go back and do it again. The audience enjoys our goof ups more than anything. You know? Yeah, love that. of course. Love to see that. The audience is another, almost like another character in our show. So oh, just yeah. getting that feedback. You know when something's working, when a bit works, right. when a joke works, whatever. It's really fun. Congratulations, guys. Season two pickup already. Yay. Thank you very yes, much. yes. 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 Yeah. Yes. Oh, Round of applause awesome. for that. I'm going to buy a zoo. I'm going to buy a zoo with all that. <laughs> <laughs> but with Good no choice. animals, I just like cages. We're having a ball, you know. I think we, this is only uh, the beginning of the of the Miller Empire. And we are, the growth is amazing. We are, we are starting to uh, gel as a unit. And then pretty soon it's going to be just called the Miller because we're going to be combined into one total Miller person. You know what I'm saying? It's the Millers right now, but once you start to come together like one big robot, big Miller robot, Miller. <laughs> the Miller. It's a big thrill for me. I know you've been on very successful shows in the past, but. A gleam. Yeah, mm. This is my first. Uh, <laughs> this is my first. Uh, second season of anything. It's like incredible. And it looks like you guys have a lot of fun on set. We too, do. Just. Yeah, and that all starts, I think, with the show's creator, Greg Garcia. Mm -hmm. I've known Greg before. I played the Earl's dad on My Name is Earl. Mm -hmm. And then mm -hmm. our director every day is Jimmy Burroughs, who's like a legend in multi-cam right. shows. Uh, he did uh, Friends and Cheers. Oh, you know, just those. Will Arnett plays your TV son. How is he? Is he a good son? Is he a good TV son? He's the very best TV son anybody could ever have. How does he compare to your other TV sons of the past? Or? They were the very best TV sons <laughs> anyone could ever have. <laughs> well, I tell you, Will is our captain, that's what I call him. He's fantastic. Mm -hmm. um, I think he's a fine actor. He's got great comic sense, comic timing. Mm -hmm. I go to him myself for help sometimes with a line if I don't know, you know how to play it. He, yeah? He's great. Is she okay with my monthly spa day? Does she have an attractive sneeze? I mean, I, like, there's no way I would have married Janice if I'd known that her sneeze was like the flush of an airplane toilet. Well, I think you guys are giving me a little tour of oh, your yeah. humble TV abode, so let's do it. You ready? Yeah, yeah where should yeah. we start? My gosh. Um, this is our living room. Yep. Yeah, how about this? Let's That's see. a telephone. How archaic is that? This is a landline. For those of you under the age of 20, mm -hmm. phones used to be plugged into the wall. Yeah. And we have one of those here on the set. And which you is... answer, I think, by doing something oh, yeah, like that. I don't remember. Whenever I hear your voice on a commercial, I just I just know it's you. Mm -hmm. And when I found out that you were playing a local news reporter, I was like, I feel like you, you may have missed your calling. You have, like, the perfect voice. You got the hair. Yeah. You got, you know. I should have. I should have done that. You I know. I. I <laughs> there, there. I remember years ago. There was a part of me that was like, maybe I should be trying to become like a news reporter. Of course, you know, you have to be a serious news reporter. You have to have studied journalism and stuff. I did it. Sure. So, unless yeah. you're Brian Williams. There. And he knows what I'm talking about. <laughs> No, he's did you a, just throw shade at no, Brian Williams? No, no. I love Brian Williams. He's like the best. He's actually the new. He's one of the people I watch. I yeah. watch CBS. But, but that Matt Lauer guy, I mean, just. I don't know what you're saying. <laughs> I think you can interpret this as you will. Uh, this is the <laughs> etc. Mm, yeah. Placard mm -hmm. that we have in our home. Also very crucial in any home. I mean, this really brings together the whole room. <laughs> yeah. There's a CD collection. That's ancient. CD yeah. collection. CDs, what's, what's kids. What's in there? And, uh, spools of thread, uh -huh. which can, could come in handy. Well, a winter storm is headed to LA and might dump as much as a 16th inch of rain. Will Arnett is on Stormwatch 2014. Will, what's the latest? Uh, well, we're out here in uh, Studio City and there's no rain. 
but everybody's freaking out. Back to you in the studio. Okay. Oh yeah, this is important to, to point out. Uh, this, this is a good thing, yeah. Uh, Bo Bridges is an excellent actor, uh, but sometimes, you know, our, our scripts change almost every day. He needs a little help sometimes, so he writes his lines down on pieces of furniture. Yeah. Usually he writes it in pencil, but sometimes just with a Sharpie. He doesn't care, really. So there's some here, There's I know there's a bunch in Will's apartment and uh, in the kitchen and stuff. He writes it on fruit sometimes, yeah. uh, but wherever. I'm not gonna lie, I've done it myself. And then occasionally we'll just sort of like move an object over the line so, yeah. so it's not there, and you'll see him sort of walk over and be like, uh, <laughs> and then just goes blank, because we, yeah. that Brando used to do that, all the greats do it. No offense to you, Bo, I love you very much.